I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a question from IB test paper on finite series. Question number 5. Evaluate sum of 3i minus 10 when the lower limit is 10 and the upper bound is 29. You can pause the video and answer the question. Now to find this sum of series we might use this formula. So let me give you the formula of sum of natural numbers which is let us say if I have i, i from 1 to n, the sum of natural numbers is n times n plus 1 divided by 2. So that's the formula which may be required. You can apply this formula, find the sum. Here is the solution for this question. Now one thing which is very critical to notice is that the lower limit is 10, not 1 right so that makes huge difference so in such cases what should we do that really means that the sum from i equals to 10 to 29 for 3i minus 10 can be found uh, by first finding the sum of first 29 terms that is i equals to 1 to 29 right of the same thing which is 3i minus 10 and from it take away the sum of first 9 terms right so from i equals to 1 to 9 if you take away that then you get the right answer do you get an idea so that is key for solving or finding or evaluating this summation okay now let's continue from here so we'll write this as equal to, so 1 to 29, we'll apply this formula. Let's open this up first. So it could be written as 3 times sum from i equals to 1 to 29 of i. So I've taken out 3 minus. Now we'll do i equals to 1 to 29. There are 29 terms of 10 is a constant right 10 times 1 you could write 10 here or outside with 1 inside minus this whole thing so let me put this in brackets it is 3 i equals to 1 to 9 for i uh, minus 10 from i equals to 1 to 9 of 10 right so these are 10 numbers so this sum applying the formula i is 29 for us so that gives us 3 times 29 times 29 plus 1 divided by 2 minus now that's the constant so 29 times we are adding 10 so we get this as 29 times 10 and here within this bracket we get 3 times 1 to 9 and is 9 here so it'll be 9 times, um, let me write 9 plus 1 divided by 2 minus the 9 tens, right? 9 tens. So that gives us 3 times uh, 29 times 30 divided by 2 minus 290 minus, let's write down 3 times 9 times 10 divided by 2 minus minus becomes plus. Uh, plus 90 right so that is what it is now we can actually use the calculator find the answer right so it is uh, 3 times 29 times 30 divided by 2 uh, equals to if you want you can write the numbers also 1305 okay let's simplify this and then do it minus 290 minus uh, we'll write 3 times 9 times 10 divided by 2 equals to 135 plus 90, right? So we have plus 90 here. And now let's calculate. We could have done it in one shot also. 1305, take away 290, take away 135 and add 90 to it to get the answer, 970. So we get 970 as our answer, right? So that is how such questions can be done. Important thing here is to look at the lower bar. It is 10, it is not one. So at times students might do a mistake, 
by not considering i equals to 10 to 29. I am Anil Kumar and I hope that helps you to avoid such mistakes in your test paper. Thank you and all the best.